There was a legend that circulated on the internet about a lost Windows XP build that was created in the year 2000. The story goes that this build was a prototype that was never released to the public. It was said to be a cursed version of the operating system that had strange glitches and bugs that would cause it to malfunction in inexplicable ways. According to the legend, the build was discovered by a group of software engineers who were working on a project to restore old computers. They stumbled upon a dusty old computer that was hidden away in the back of a storage room. When they turned it on, they were surprised to find that it was running an early version of Windows XP that they had never seen before. As they began to explore the operating system, they noticed that it was behaving strangely. Icons would randomly disappear from the desktop, menus would open and close on their own, and strange error messages would pop up at random intervals. The engineers tried to debug the system, but no matter what they did, the strange glitches persisted. As time went on, the engineers began to notice something even more disturbing. Whenever they worked on the computer late at night, strange whispers could be heard coming from the speakers. They couldn't make out what was being said, but the voices sounded like they were coming from deep within the operating system itself. One night as they were working on the computer, the screen suddenly went black. When it came back on, they were shocked to see that the desktop had been replaced with a single folder labeled, Do Not Open. Despite their better judgment, they clicked on the folder, only to be greeted with a single file labeled, death.exe. Before they could do anything else, the computer shut down. When they tried to turn it back on, it refused to start up, and the hard drive was completely wiped clean. The engineers never found out what happened to that lost Windows XP build, but the legend lives on as a cautionary tale about the dangers of exploring the unknown.